This is Florida Gulf Coast University. Senior Project is a culminating experience for all FGCU art majors. These 11 students have taken the challenge to build on their learning experience and create an exhibition. They come up with an idea, uh, they start to research the idea, they do tests on materials, they've constructed these pieces that they care about, that engage them. I'm Sarah Hines, my exhibition is titled Accuracy. It is a brand identity and product launch for a health and fitness tracking device. It's my way of combining my love of fitness with my love of design. Everyone's body is unique and everyone reacts differently to food and exercise. So. I wanted to come up with a product that could generate accurate information and help people obtain specific goals. I'm George Cochran Jr. My project is entitled A Different Perspective. I partnered this course with my senior seminar class in which we had to pick a service learning project. And I picked Gigi's Playhouse, it's Down Syndrome Achievement Center. They're trying to get started in this area. And I thought, what better way to help than uh, do some portraits of people with Down syndrome. Most of what you hear about Down syndrome is negative. I wanted to give that a positive spin, show a positive side to it. My name is Cheryl Lee. My senior project exhibition is titled A Captain's Soul. All the situations and life that you go through. There's good times, there's bad times, ups and downs. And I related that to the waves of the ocean. As the waves of the ocean beat against the driftwood that I've used in my work, it takes away all of the rough and it's constantly changing the wood into different shapes, different colors, different sizes. My name is Andrew Kalis. My series is titled Scapes. My original goal was to uh, create a narrative space that is a conceptual environment and a three-dimensional engine that you can see my creative thought process alongside of uh, my visualization. I worked with a combination of uh, drawing, sketching with mixed media, collage, painting, and finally the capstone was to use 3D rendering and uh, a little touch of animation. My name is Lauren Ricker. My project and the exhibition is entitled Octo. It is what it sounds like. It's a giant octopus and it's uh, created out of steel piping that I cut individually using a bandsaw and then welded it together in the shape of an octopus. My name is Chris Vacha. My exhibition is called Nature of the Beast. I fell in love with photography a long time ago. Basically, the concept behind it all is with photography comes a lot of frustration. So you get the camera settings wrong, your pictures aren't cropped right, if your frames are messed up, of course nobody likes that. My name is Quinn Miller and my senior exhibition was called No Fear. It was a great way to be able to use something I'm in love with, photography, to explore these fears more rational, not irrational. Because I've always worked with other people's emotions, but I've never worked with my own. There's an incredible range of practice in our time. And I'm very pleased that FTCU does not have a house style. Our students don't come out looking in a particular kind of way. They come out looking like themselves. My name is Hannah Johnson, and my senior project exhibition is titled Opus Montum. I've been exploring concepts of both present moment living and growth through change. What I've been doing is completing these from left to right, section by section, moment by moment, reflecting on the present moment and trying to express my emotions through both color and style. I am Anthony Ward. My title of my work is Flotano. There's something about each little piece. I mean, it just might look like junk to a lot of you. It might look like you might notice something in there. It's like a, a whole bunch of little funny things. But it's the orchestration of it all. I'm about, I like kinetics, and I learned it just automatically, I guess. My name's Alexa Bone. I did the work entitled Field of My Bones. They're all hand-sculpted ceramic skulls with big attachments. I use these pieces as sort of a self-portraiture to display the fragile parts as well as the beautiful parts of my life and me. It's always been really, really hard for me to verbally express what I'm feeling. Putting it into my artwork is so much easier. My name is Mark Pouchet. I have the senior exhibition titled Quantum Discontinuity. The mind has multiple ways to react to experience. You can react from habit or conditioning, or you can be present enough to react consciously. What you see in the gallery is not only these understandings, but the methods of application and exploration in meditation of these principles. You guys do not know how much this means to all of us. We cannot appreciate it more. 